Hey, this is the 2023 track for East Bay Slot Car Club. Wanted to spend a minute and talk about track design. We got a couple of tips from Johnny Hobby and got to give him credit. If you haven't seen Johnny Hobby on YouTube, check him out. So we've got a start finish here and that's cool. And we also have two fueling stops. Notice that there are lane changes in front of them. So if your ding dong friend is in the fueling stop and gonna come out on you, you're able to get away and go to the outside to go around. Or if you wanna get to it and you're on the outside, you can change in and go to the fueling stop or change in and go to the fueling stop. After we come back up and around through this nice easy curve, easy curve, tighter curve, we wanted to have a little bit of technical on this year's, but we also wanted to have some higher speed so there's more space in between the curves than there was last year. You're able to dive down on the inside to get around somebody at this curve. And more importantly, there are a couple of lane changers here. Uh, if you're not really paying attention, it might not seem like much, but what they do is they allow you to change to the outside of the curve or the outside of the curve and we think that you can run the car a little bit faster on the outside than you can on the inside there's a lane change right before the timing section that's the blue mark again it's a straightaway want to get around somebody there you go there is another lane change after the straightaway so if you're bottled up and uh, then there's another one to get to the inside because it's such a, a long uh, bank curve that maybe you can get a little bit faster by going a shorter distance and then we're back to the start. That is the lane change discipline that's going on on the track this year in addition to all of the elevation change.